All right, guys, Steve and Jenny are back out here. We've got a friend with us, Dave. How's it going, Dave? It's going great. We've already found our first find of the day. <laughs> Jenny found my weight pocket that <laughs> fell out while we were hiking. It's yeah. a good thing we found that before we got to the cliffs that we're going to. Indeed. Anyways, we're heading out to a popular cliff site where a lot of college kids, high school kids come out and jump, and there's always treasures to be found. So we're going to get in the water. We got a bit of a hike to go, but we're going to go give press our luck and see what we can find. And watch if we find anything, stay tuned to the end. We'll definitely try and find the owner and get it back to him. All right, we made it. Let's get in the water and find some treasure.
right, that was a great dive. It's a lot of fun. Was it as murky as you remember, Dave? It was exactly as murky as I remember. <laughs> I only got lost like four times. Oh, man. <laughs> Was, did you ever see my yellow fence? I got yellow fence so people could see me on that mark. I, I did. I saw the yellow fence, and then Jay's my, fence my hit my <laughs> mask, and then I got lost. <laughs> then I saw the yellow fence. I saw Jenny's pink tank, and then I got lost. Awesome. Uh, I got lost a lot. Yeah. <laughs> it's easy it's down easy. there. It's easy. But we did find a lot of stuff, so let's flip around and look at some of the stuff that we found. Dave, we'll start with your mind. First thing I found was a JBL Bluetooth speaker. Um, I don't think it's waterproof anymore. It may have uh, a little problem. It's a charge four. We found a couple of glasses, um, just, you know, normal jump in the water, lose your sunglasses. These are the hardest ones. We know that people have gone to great lengths. In fact, Sophie put her name on a wonderful bracelet and then she lost it. Um, these are just sitting down there waiting for somebody to come get them. Uh, we found a Bic lighter. Those don't work well underwater. We found that they the less effective that way. A uh, bunch of vapes, so if you're gonna go cliff jumping, don't vape while you're <laughs> cliff jumping. It, it just it just doesn't work, you lose it, and then you gotta go buy another one. <laughs> we did find a dollar. Look at that, dollar bill. No coins. You got paid to dive today. Just a dollar, Dave. exactly. Now, I'm a really bad golfer, and so this is the, probably my favorite find, is a whole string of golf balls. Look at that. Hole number one, number two. No, basically, I'm going to lose one of those on every hole, and so that's one of the reasons that I dive is just to be able to afford golf. There you go. Um, we found a couple of uh, Mardi Gras beads. Don't want to know how those got down there. What about your Ferragamos? Oh, that's right. We did find a pair of Ferragamo sunglasses. We put them on and realized very quickly their prescription. I can't see with these on. So if you lost a pair of Ferragamo prescription sunglasses at Squirrel Lake, um, contact us because I can't wear them. Yeah. We'd be happy to get them back to you. That's an expensive pair of prescription glasses right there. The sunglasses run around $350. Yes, around I did $350, see $350 for sunglasses. Anyways. Well, cool. All right, Jenny, show us what you found. Okay. Nothing really cool, but hair clips are always there. I do love the golf balls. We've got hair ties, bracelets, and I loved these. They were kind of cute. So they were in <laughs> <Retro>. good shape. <laughs> and then these ones were actually really nice. These are Ray-Ban prescription glasses. A really slight prescription. So they are the Ray-Ban. So there again, if you lost your prescription Ray-Ban. Ray-Ban. <laughs> Ray-Ban. Ray-Ban glasses, let Ray us know. And then brand. these are in good Raisin shape brand. too. So add to our collection. Cool. Squirrel. Sorry. All right, go ahead. Like a little squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, another, it must have been a big lighter day. Oh, wait, this one's Circle K. And, Circle K. And a bunch of vapes. Um, I think that's it. All right. I, I did find a lot of garbage and some, like, busted hats that are Yeah, now we've in we got a whole garbage, garbage bag. bag full of trash that we're going to be throwing away. Yes. All right. All right. So, let's see your stuff. Found sunglasses. This is probably my best pair. They're all just no-namers, but uh, it's always fun finding sunglasses. These were kind of cool. Almost almost the John Lennon look, <laughs> but not really. Um, vapes. This, I was really excited when I saw the GoPro. This part was covered up. I'm like, oh, we found a GoPro. I pulled it out, but no such luck. So now, Nora, I know how you felt when you found the GoPro strap with no GoPro attached to it. Anyways, it was kind of cool to find that. I found a pair of Vans. That Whoops. is not something that you typically find. You usually yeah. find one pair. There are these are, one pair? You usually find you one usually shoe. find one shoe. I found a pair. They're not bad. There's a little bit of holes in them, but kind of cool. Um, this was a nicer pair, or a nicer shoe, not a pair. I found a hat. I found some vapes. These were really cool. Um, I just saw them sitting there. I was hoping that they were gold, Wait, but they're not. got to focus on them. There. Cool ring, so those but, are pretty. Uh, anyways, okay. Found a the hat. I did find an unopened bottle of Gatorade. Bottle of Gatorade. Are you brave enough to drink oh, that? Try it. Do you like that flavor? Let's just see. Oh no! Like oh no! Does, does it smell? Let me be the judge of that. Oh! oh no! <laughs> it's good. It was protected. <laughs> okay, what's? I did find a phone. So check this bad boy out. 
we are gonna open it up, see if we can dry it out and find the owner, right? So I don't know. It's been in the water a little while, but we'll see. We'll see what we can find. Let's see if we can find the That was kind of a funny find. I'm looking also and I see a phone. So <laughs> not the typical phone that we find, but here's the one that we find. Hey, and I forgot, we did find a kayak paddle. And we know the guys over at Redline, so we'll be able to get this back to them. We've got another one of their piles at home, too. So, yeah. Kind of cool. I'm going to return those. Dive. Dave, thanks for coming out. That was My awesome. pleasure. Go check out Dave's channel, Scuba Daver. We'll have his link below. Um, and he's got a lot of fun adventures out there, different places that he dives as well. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give us a thumbs up if you do. Go check out our merch at trippandiveshop.com if you want to support the channel, and we'll catch you on our next adventure. If I could find a SIM card, see if I can find the owner to it. But I have looked all over and I can't seem to find the SIM card. So if you know how to find the SIM card in this, drop me a comment below and let me know. I'd really love to find the owner of this phone. Mm -hmm.